Well, Cameron is back from Australia with an update on a former dancing champ, Bendy Irwin. We all fell in love with her on dancing, and now she is head over heels, and she talked to you about their romance. And I've talked to Bendy so many times. Everybody's always asking her about her boyfriend because they say they are so in love, but this is the first time they've ever sat down together to talk about it. So what have you guys learned about trying to have a relationship in the spotlight? I feel so blessed that I actually managed to find you're, you're kind of like my soulmate. Like, I am so oh, grateful that I found cool. someone who... It's challenging for us just because our relationship has been long distance for a long time. Yeah. I mean, we met three years ago now. People are always wondering whether we're engaged or yeah. married. Uh, it's like, people like me, but... No, no. no. Yeah. Okay. The marriage plans are that no marriage in the... Kind of right now, yeah. like like yeah, that's that's years and years away. Okay, yeah, I think you feel the same. Yeah, I think so. I think we're just enjoying the now and we're just enjoying being together. Bindi just turned 18 and Chandler is 19, and I found out the sentimental way Chandler won Bindi's heart. It happened after the day they first met. So I go and meet Chandler. I was like, wow, this American guy's okay. <laughs> and then I didn't hear from Chandler for quite a while afterwards, and that's because. He sent a letter asking my mum if he could stay in contact with me. <laughs> and then mum gave it, the letter to me and said, is this the person real? <laughs> <laughs> and then that we've stayed in so touch ever since. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Yeah, yeah, it was funny because after I had met her, I, was, I really want to stay in touch, but I don't want to, I don't know, come across wrong or anything like that. <laughs> I think this is the best way to handle it. I'm going to give it a go. And yeah, and that was that. I was thinking that maybe today would be a good day since we have the wonderful entertainment tonight with us for you to start feeding the crocodiles. What do you think? Yeah? yeah. All right. Well Chandler's now spending some time in Oz and has a job alongside Bindi at the Australia Zoo, and he's even doing some of the exact same things Bindi's yeah. dad, Steve Irwin, did, like feeding the crocs and doing some wrangling for research. Oh. I saw you jump a 15-foot yeah. crocodile. Yeah, it's, it's really yep. cool. You jumped the head, and yeah, I was I so proud. Of one of them, so yeah. I think her name was Madison. And it's like dominoes. It's like yeah. bang, 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 bang. Like once you say go, it's just you have That's to go. That's it. You're yeah. committed. If you don't go, you're like putting everyone else in jeopardy. Yeah. Bindi gave me a tour of their wildlife animal hospital, and I got some very hands-on experience at the zoo. You've now made a friend for life. 